I am granting you permission. Now, it is not an omission or admission of guilt or that you're doing something wrong. All along, you have been perfect. And by no means do I mean perfect in terms of perfectionism. I mean perfect as you are beautifully and wonderfully made. We fade away when we are striving to hit an unreasonable mark, a mark of everyone else's expectations. We've become nations of status quo zombies and robots when it is not the reason why we're put on this earth in the first place. So here I am making my case. The case and the truth of the matter is that you matter and what you're after may not exactly be what you're put on this earth to do. So I'm giving you permission to break free from the chains, to reclaim the gains from the pains you have experienced by being uniquely you. And if that's true, is it true that by being yourself unapologetically, we are prophetically manifesting our greatness into existence? The resistance comes not from others, but it comes from within ourselves. We delve into this journey of truth and liberation, but here's the explanation of things, my friends. The means to the end does not end up where you had thought all along. It's actually from what had made us strong. It's actually what brings closer to the source because we have been forced to pigeonhole ourselves into these boxes, forcing ourselves to be square when there's an air of individuality that you have not yet stepped in. So that my friends is where the work begins. I am giving you permission. Yes, it is a permission slip so that you do not dip into mediocrity when you are a rarity. And that is something that someone had said that was so profound to me. That you are a unique gem, but only a fraction of the hem of the fabric that connects us and collects us into a higher consciousness, a collective, respective of what our parents and other generations have told us. What holds us back is our own selves, so it's time to delve even deeper. Unlock the chains, unpack the boxes. It's time to harvest deep within our hearts so that we can stand apart as the magnificent, beautiful, wondrous, luminous, radiant beings that we are. So are you catching my drift so far? In closing, I am inviting you to stop posing as someone that doesn't sit well with who you are and is out of alignment because we need that refinement, that refinement of the edges because those edges are what gives us the edge. And so do you make the pledge to accept my permission slip, this little quip that I came up with in the middle of the day because what I want to say needs to be said and read and spread throughout the universe because this verse in isolation is what makes things worse. Despite what anyone says, we are all connected, protected, respected, but only if we truly respect ourselves. So friends, sign that permission slip and hopefully to this end, you will understand where the need is to mend within ourselves and with each other. And so, I will send that permission slip so that you can send yourself into greatness.